guys, welcome back. Bah. Oh god. We are in <laughs> an onsen. Yes, we are in an onsen in Fukushima. Hawaiian's resort. Yeah. Largest outdoor onsen in Japan. There's a swimming pool, there's onsens oh, everywhere back. out here. Yeah. It's awesome. There's also live shows as well. Live shows. It's really awesome. Uh, we've just finished our time in Fukushima. Yep. It's been a good one. Uh, first we started at Kitakata Ramen. Yep. And uh, all you can eat ramen. Yeah, that was lovely. Unfortunately, <laughs> didn't end too well. No, we only had three bowls of ramen. Three bowls each, yeah. yeah Top one. Yeah! <laughs> Probably shouldn't have done that. So we are in Fukushima Prefecture, right? Yeah, we're in Fukushima in Kitakata. In Kitakata, which is like Kit Kats with an A on the end. And yeah. basically it's famous for its ramen. We're in Ramen Khan right now and this is where we're going to have all you can eat ramen. Yeah, I don't know if that's a good idea. So in Japan it's got the highest number of ramen shops per capita than anywhere. Yeah. So I don't know how many that is, but it's quite a lot basically. Yeah. Then we went to Tsurukajo and that was a castle in Fukushima. And very ancient castle, but it was rebuilt because it was blown up. Blown up, didn't it? Yeah. Terrible shame that. Hey guys. Hi. We are at the Suzuka Castle right now in Fukushima, and yeah, it's really beautiful. I think, isn't it? Beautiful, but cold, snowing. Yeah. Whoa. It was built 600 years ago, then blown up in the late 1800s and rebuilt in 1965. Uh, so it is a replica now, but it does look stunning. Yeah, and you can go inside, there's lots of history that you can read inside there as well, which is really amazing. This castle was really strategically important uh, for ruling East Japan, so it has a really interesting history. If you're interested in Japanese history, definitely come yeah. check it out. Yeah. Then we went to Otsujuku, the ancient town, there's the stopping off point for people yeah. going from Tokyo uh, to Tohoku, that was pretty cool. Yeah, that was really nice. Like going back very, in time. Very cold, but mm. really nice, beautiful. Hi, guys. Hi, we're in Ochijuku right now, and we are in a gorgeous town. This is an old and Japanese town from the Edo period. Yeah, it's uh, deep in the heart of the mountains of Fukushima, and it's a, a stop off point for samurai and people and merchants traveling from Tohoku to Tokyo, which was called Edo back then. Mm. Uh, so, this is where they would come, they'd have a few beers, have a few drinks, relax, and then carry on along their way. Yeah. But it's really secluded, which yeah. surprises me. I don't know it's how not... they would have even got here. Yeah. Like, it's right in the heart of the mountains, yeah. and we had to go through like five tunnels just to get yeah. here. So but don't know how they got here. Gorgeous, all, the, all the roofs are thatched. In the Meiji area, a whole new route was used, and uh, this was kind of forgotten. So they preserved it so that people can come from around the world and enjoy mm. thatched roofs and soba noodles, which is famous in this area. Yeah. Soba noodles. Yeah. Should we go and try them? Yeah, let's go try. <laughs> let's go. Let's get out the cold. And uh, then we stayed at Koryama yeah. one night and uh, we found yeah. ourselves here. Yeah, so now this is the uh, Hawaiian spa, spa resort. resort. But uh, the Hawaiian spa resort was built to try and save the economy of Iwaki and kind of generate some interest as they were having some hard times a few decades ago, I think in the 1950s. Um, but yeah, no, it's a really cool place. It's really cool. Absolutely yeah, huge, yeah. absolutely huge. And it's yeah. like 3,000 yen for entries, it's not so bad, it's pretty cheap. Yeah. And there's a slide. Yeah, two water slides. slides. Two oh, slides. So much fun. Yeah. Come on down, bring the family, bring the cats. It's going to be a lot of fun. Cats. Loki's scary, is it not? So, this is the end. Yeah, this is the end of the, the end journey. Of our tour, we've been together. But, um... <laughs> 
Uh, Kim will be travelling on. Yeah, so I'll be in the next trip. We're going to Gunma, Tojiki, Ibaraki and Shiba. So you'll see me in the next trip. But and I may or may not return later on down the line. But if you uh, enjoyed watching me fumble around with Kim Dao, be sure to subscribe to Born Japan. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you yeah. later. Yeah.